Yo guys, what's going on? Zace is here today with another video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the new updates here today from Battle State Games and what's going on here in Escape from Tarkov. We had the Tarkov Twitter account and the Battle State Games Twitter account both tweet out different images. Usually they're the same, but this time they were a little bit different. And we're going to talk about the significance of that here in just a moment. But we also had the trader discounts come to an end, which is in direct correlation with what Battlestate Games and the Tarkov Twitter account have tweeted. But before we check out those images, do me a favor. Make sure you're hitting that like button. Let's shoot for 50 likes. I know you guys can smash that. And make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel because this content might be closer than we think so let's hop into the first image now we're not going to spend too much time on this first image because we're going to go directly to the second image and then come back to the first image because the first one is a little more important so this one came out first this image right here there's a cell phone with a bunch of text on it then there is a line of morse code and then this is the second image that was tweeted just two minutes later with additional Morse code. Now, from what I can understand from the rough translations we have gotten about 15 to 13 minutes deep into this thing, is the Morse code is essentially translating to the Lightkeeper saying stop the discounts or worse will happen. Uh, Axel actually said that it translates to stop all the discounts or you guys will be fucked. I saw other translations from Morse code translators saying that it will be worse. Something along the lines of there's going to be a consequence if the traders do not stop the discount. And that is exactly what has happened. So you can see we are back to the zero percent so hopefully you guys did see my video about buying usd and euros because now that the prices have returned to normal you're essentially still getting your 30 percent discount since you bought that usd for 30 percent less and now that the prices are all back to normal you're basically still getting that 30 percent off because you have 30 percent more usd than you originally would have gotten if there wasn't a sale if that makes sense but if you missed that video, I am sorry. That's why you need to be subscribed here on this channel. But let's talk about the most important thing about what was tweeted here today. Let's go back to that first image. Do you guys notice anything? Just look at it. Maybe pause the video even if you want to actually have give yourself a like guessing chance. All right? Now that you're done pausing, let's hop into it. So the first thing is the phone is on a plate. It's on a plate of armor. So this is either going to give us two things. It means the armor plates are very, very close. Now remember, Battlestate Games does everything intentionally with these images, with these event things. Everything's intentional. So this armor plate right here is either signifying that the plate system is nearly done, is already done, and it's almost ready to be shipped out to us as a final product, or it means all of the rig customization is very close to finish everything i just said about the plates can be said then for customizable rigs we have known nikita has wanted this for a very long time and hopefully it's going to be done for this next wipe but there's one other thing in this image that i noticed at least and if you look at the top left of the screen that's an under barrel grenade launcher and i can't tell if it's on an ak or it kind of looks like an ak to me just based off of um the pistol grip it kind of looks like an rk3 but it's it, it's very low lighting um but we have an under barrel grenade launcher there like i said every single thing is intentional that they do here and i would love for under barrels to be finally in the game we have a skill for them i do believe or at least it's the skill for grenade launchers um let me see under barrel launchers we actually have an individual skill for under barrel launchers right here so you know i'm down i am fully down to have under barrel smoke grenades you know all the regular grenades that we can already have for the gl and maybe even an m32 coming very soon with big pipe who knows but um you know having even the shotgun rounds that we have for the gl you know that could make things a little interesting flash grenades smoke grenades regular grenades you know there's a ton of different stuff they could do with them and i think it would introduce a really cool dynamic and uh, a lot more people would start running ARs, assuming they're not completely broken like the GL because those underbarrel launchers are going to be a little more accessible to the general public when it comes to not buying GLs and shit. When you have something a little more accessible, you're going to have to nerf the grenades a little bit, but if it's going to be introduced in the next wipe, I am so down. I am ready for them, and um, honestly, I'm, I'm kind of excited just seeing this image. So that's what we got so far, though. As for the text message on screen, on the phone, on the plate... Um, there was not a translation for that from what I have seen so far. 
If there's a new one, I probably won't make an update video, so just check the Tarkov Twitter account for that, and, uh, you know, maybe check back in a couple hours to see if somebody has done a full translation of that text message. Maybe it's something important, but I didn't want to wait super long when I had the majority of the information already ready for you guys, so that's why I went and shipped the video already this quickly. So... Thank you guys so much for stopping by today. As always, make sure you guys are dropping a like on this video. Like I said, let's shoot for 50 likes. Make sure you guys are subscribed so you don't miss this new content when it does come out. And as always, the sponsors and equipment I use in the description below. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. I'm out.